what led to be switching to Atlanta Phase Squad was I've run Flex for every year except one year. So it's just like one of those things that's always in the back of my head where it's like, I gotta do my thing. I wanna be that main guy. Hello, I'm Alex Anderson. I go by RCs, and here are my Cold War settings. And RCs able to win the one on two. Are you kidding me? RCs kills the entire lobby. What a snap from RCs. Here's my sense. I go with 5-5. Five, five. I only use 1.0, 1.0 on both, just because it's easier. It's it's just too, all that's just too much for me. I'm, I, I just shoot my gun. He gets the kill! I do play on tactical, so it's easier, so I can actually, so I punch with this and slide with my right stick, just because it just feels natural to me. I do not play inverted. It's just, that's just weird. I've never, I've never been able to. It's so different compared to like MW, because there's like, tap the slides automatically in. There, you can't drop shot anymore. So if, if you get caught drop shotting, you're not gonna be able to shoot back. I just take that out right now in Cold War and just not use it. What y'all should be excited for with the release of Cold War is just new maps, just new everything, and just having like a, just a change of scenery, I'm just super excited for. And MW, I think we all got to the point where everyone knows you're gonna go here, 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 while in Cold War, this the maps are so big and just like, there's so many places you could go, so many different head glitches. It's just a, an AR's world. And the biggest difference between MW and to Cold War is uh, there's many more guns to choose from. There's so many more options to use that I feel like right now is like the perfect time to, to be testing every attachment you can unlock, every gun. One thing you should be looking out for in this game is the duster stock, and it's super useful. You, you slide super far, and uh, you'll catch up on, its, uh, on, their, on their tippy toes trying to kill you. My number one tip for someone that's trying to make it into the league is uh, I, I just listen. I listen to what everyone says. I want to take anything to heart. You just want to improve who you are as a teammate, as a player. Sit back, let someone else say something to you, and just take it all in without getting upset or uh, mad at someone. I can't wait to get this year going.